Hello guys, welcome to Amit Things. In this video, learn how to install the current Python version on Windows 11. Let's begin. For that, uh, go to the web browser. I am using Chrome. You can use any web browser. On Google type Python and uh, press enter. On pressing enter, the official website is visible. Click on it, python.org. Here it is. Now keep the mouse cursor on downloads and the current version will be visible that is 3.12.1. Click on it to download. Now the download started. Here it is. Let's wait. The download completed exe file. Now right click, click open to begin the installation. Minimize. Now the installation started. Here it is. First select use admin privileges, then the add python.exe to path. That's it. Now click on customize installation. Optional features are visible. All of them are selected, which is fine. Pip, pip is a package manager used to download, install and manage python packages and libraries, which is fine. This is an IDLE which will get installed. Python IDLE which is an ID to run python programs. Keep it as it is and click next. Advanced option, first select install python for all users. Now rest keep as it is, it will automatically add the python to environment variables. So you don't need to do it manually later. Keep it as it is, it will get installed here in the following location program files. Click browse if you want to change the location. But keep it as default. Click install. A setup started, let's wait. Setup is successful. Click close. Now let us verify the installation. Go to start. Type cmd. Click on open to open the command prompt. Now here in type the command python space hyphen hyphen version and press enter. This shows that we successfully installed python current version. Now type py and press enter. This will start the python shell. You can print directly here. Let's say I'll print the following. Press enter and it will display it. You can also go to IDLE. Go to start type IDLE. Click on open to open it. Here and you can run your program. You can type the same command. And whatever you will add here, it will get printed. Press enter. Okay, you can also save this program now. File save as desktop. Let's say I'll name it amit.py. Click save and it will be displayed here. Here it is. To run Python programs, you can also use PyCharm, Anaconda, or Google Colab. For that, you can refer the links in the description of this video for the complete tutorials. Also, you can refer our Python complete tutorials the same we have added in the video description thank you for watching the video